soon as the shit hits the fan, it's just this all comes out in the open, you know, what I planned, my plans. Huh. Matt Marion's gonna be saying to anybody who listens to, you know, her husband, her kid, my mom, in regards to me, I should have left her in that goddamn shelter to rot. Yep, you should have. You wanted to guarantee that, that for me to not fuck up your plans, yeah, you should have left me in the goddamn shelter to run. And Donald and Hope should have never allowed me back into their home. I don't force people to treat me like shit. I don't force people to commit criminal acts against me. Contrary to what some people might think. The mint's still my favorite. I guess I won't be going to court today after all. I'm tired. Mm, I'm gonna go back to bed. I still don't sleep. Went to bed earlier. Went to bed at four. I was up before eight. It's not enough sleep. You let your long-time enemy get in here where I can see first him what was going on and talk to my mom and whatnot. And now my mom really wants me here for good reason. <laughs> I just left her in that goddamn shelter to rock. I wish I had him in that. Yeah, well, you didn't. <laughs> As is your usual arrogant nature. You underestimated me, you didn't. Or you just think, oh, She's just on psych disability, or she'll be so appreciative that I don't have her in that shelter anymore. And yeah, yeah, it yeah, shouldn't have been up to you, Marion. Anyway, it should have been up to my mom only. I can't pull the wool over my eyes. Unfortunately, you can pull the wool over everyone else's eyes. And my family. And your family, mom's friends, whatever. Not over mine. Oh, and not over the eyes of my mom's quote unquote crazy friends, or just her so called normal friends and normal family members. You have them all under your. The phony story you present to the world. And I don't believe for a second. 
based simply on your attitude and behavior. I don't believe it for a second. And it doesn't matter what it, it doesn't matter because it wouldn't matter if I was the only one who believes that you're out to steal my rifle and it runs right out from under me. I have every right in the universe to pursue this by legal right to, to you know let a judge decide. You're strong and powerful and convincing and the judge might just completely brush me away like a fly and say, you know, your aunt's doing a good job and doing a good job caring for your mom and your money and whatever and you weren't around and, you know, and that's it, I'll have to accept it, but I'll have closure and it'll be out in the open because it's not going to happen automatically. I mean, my mom will have to talk to me. Pull it down the truth. See what happens. We still have closure. Even if it costs me like four thousand dollars, it'd be worth it. I'll have closure. A judge will decide, and that will be that. I certainly won't fight it anymore. I'm not going to deplete my savings.